A pizza delivery man is shot and killed in northwest Indiana. Police in Gary found the victim's body in the trunk of his car just hours after he had called police to report a robbery. The victim told police he was chased by a group of people who approached him while he was delivering pizza to a home in Gary overnight. Six hours later, officers on patrol came upon the delivery man's car and found his body inside the trunk. ABC 7's Karen Jordan is joining us now with more on the investigation. Karen? Well, Cheryl and Ron, uh, Latuan Wiggins aspired to be a rapper, but in the meantime, the 29-year-old supported his family by working full-time as a pizza delivery man. His fiancé says that he was a hard worker and doesn't know why this would happen to him. He was an extraordinary person. Very lovely. Dewana Martin says the last time she talked to her fiancé, Latuan Wiggins, was around 12.30 this morning at the end of his shift as a delivery man for this Merrillville Domino's pizza. She says he sounded stressed out and ready to come home. He told me, you know, I'm going to stop and get some cigarettes and I'm on my way home. But Wiggins never made it home. Around 6 this morning, his car was found near 42nd and Maryland in Gary. His keys were in the ignition and his body was in the trunk. Police say he had been beaten and had a gunshot wound to his chest. We really need the public's help in finding out who did this so that we can at least have some justice for their family, for their mother, the brother, the, the fiance even, the child. Gary police are investigating both the homicide and the events that happened hours before Wiggins' body was found. It was around midnight when Wiggins delivered a pizza to the 1500 block of East 51st Avenue in Gary. Police say he told authorities five to six men ran toward him. One had a bat. Wiggins dropped the pizza, ran back to the Domino's and called police, who later brought him back to that location. His car was there untouched, and he was given clearance by police to drive away. Then several hours later, he was found dead in his car. Wiggins' fiance says she still doesn't believe what happened and that the father of their six-month-old daughter was well-known and well-liked in their community. I still don't believe it. Still waiting on the call my phone. Martin says the management at the Domino's has been helpful and offered her their support. But when asked, Domino's would not make any comments about what happened. At this point, Gary, police are not ready to say whether that initial robbery is connected to the homicide. All right. Thanks, Karen.